All these academics are hanging out on Twitter, posting news stories, talking about their day, talking about how they're using their research in real life. And my students have their phone in their pocket, right? Like we'll return our textbooks, we'll forget what we've read about, but you won't forget your phone at home. Or if you do, it's a catastrophe. And so I can get to students where they are, even if they're on the bus or if they're on vacation. And I think that that's why uh, the iPhone for me would be an indispensable teaching tool. So one of the things that I do when I teach with a phone is I hashtag all of my classes. So right now I'm teaching a class on theory. It's REL 100. It's a required class for the religion major. In another class, I taught a seminar uh, called Religion and Empire. We hashtagged our class REL EMP UVM, really creative. And what was great about that class was that they had to they had to tweet each other, they had to tweet news stories, and they had to tweet at authors. That kind of real-time stuff wouldn't normally be accessible to students, but through digital technology, and again, the technology that's in their pocket, they can all of a sudden have this robust interaction with the sources as they're unfolding. That's my goal. How do you make these things real for students when they were written in the 18th century or the 19th century or the early 20th century?